guys, welcome back to Call Me Horsey, and you can call me that. So today, I will be showing you guys, slash introducing you guys to all of my Equinox Arabians. I have, I do have six of them. So let's get right in to it. I'm hoping to collect more, even though that seems like a ridiculous amount, al amount already, because it, um, it kind of is. Um, anyways... <laughs> Let's let's get into me showing you. So first horse here is um Mini Fridge. He is my wild caught Arabian <laughs> Equinox Arabian. And his tax set is red pearl. I do not know why the uh the floating candle aura is there. I'm thinking of changing it to a red rose aura or something. So tell me if you have one of those. Also, tell me if you have a red witch hat or a red scarecrow hat for him. He is really pretty. He's probably my favorite one. Here are his stats. And um, here I'm showing you how he was wild caught on Mountain Island. I actually have a video on my channel that I posted earlier today of me catching him. Alrighty, next we have Nightstar. And she was my first Equinox Arabian that I obtained through the chest by Maple Keys. With maple keys, I mean. <laughs> and her tax set is the stars and dark blue. So basically dark blue and white. Uh, tell me down below if you do have a dark blue witch hat. Or a dark blue and white witch hat would be great. Dark blue has to be the main color though. I know that's a lot of uh, me asking for. But <laughs> hey. So I do really love her. And I borrowed the angelic aura off of Moonstone for her. So I do need another one of those. Here are her stats. And she is 13.1 hands high. She is super duper small and she's natural like that. Next here we have Firefly and I traded Child for him. Um, Child bought him and I did name him Firefly. I put a poll on my community tab and the highest poll vote was Firefly, which I'm really glad because it matches him really well. It like really suits him. He's probably another one of my favorites out of all of them. Honestly, I love all of them. They are so cute. I love the tax sets for them. So, yeah, he is really, really pretty. I quite enjoy his tax set. It matches him really well. Here are his stats. So, as you can see, he's bought and he's 14.3 hands high. Next, we have another one of my favorites. This is Summer and he is um, my baby pink and peach and pastel red horse. And I love the little halo. I love the glasses that match him. They match him so well. Um, and he's just so pretty. I love him. Um, I do need more accessories for him. But honestly, I kind of really like how he looks just like this. Because it's like really cute. I like the kind of like plainness of him. He's really cute. I really like him. And here are his stats. He was obtained, not by me. And he is also 85% purebred, which is great. Next, we have Milo. Now, she was my forever fool, but I grew her up stupidly, not realizing, hey, horsey, you could just, you could have just traded her. You could have just swapped her. Somebody would have loved that forever fool. Um, so I stupidly grew her up. And uh, her tax set is very incomplete. I really need to change it. I really need to figure out what's going on with it. But I, I think she's really cute. And I dyed her candy corn fade. And here are her stats. As you can see, she was also obtained. Here is Mystery. And he is my baby blue horse. He has overcast fade dyes, which matches him literally so well. And take a moment to admire his glasses. I believe I zoom in on it. His glasses and his um, antenna match perfectly because it's black pearl and baby blue and black pearl and baby blue. So I'm really, really happy about that and how perfectly it goes together. And I just think his tax set is so like just perfect and it just like fits together like a puzzle, if that makes sense. And I just, he's so cute. Oh my goodness. Now here are his stats. He is 100% purebred, which I really, really like. Alright guys, so that was um, an overview of all my Equinox Arabians. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like and maybe 
if you haven't yet, subscribe. Because we are so close to 1,000 subscribers, which is just crazy. Um, anyways, thanks again for watching. And I will see you in my next YouTube video. Goodbye, everyone.